Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Today I'll be sharing my build for the Death Knell Mecha. Let's dive right in. First, I want to highlight a specific module that I find works well with every Mecha, including Death Knell. After experimenting with various mods, I found my go-to modules for Death Knell. To start, I removed all other modules to showcase Death Knell's normal damage in the training grounds. In its default state, Death Knell deals 207 damage for durability and health. However, when using its Scythe ability, it deals 500 base damage plus 5 additional damage based on the mecha's health. Additionally, when using the Scythe ability again on the main health, it deals 505 damage. The Beacon ability still deals the same damage with his normal attack damage. And for gotcha. the side, which deals damage ranging from 605 to 505. Rest easy. Threats are all clear. Now let's move away from the training grounds and equip the chosen modules on Death Knell. As mentioned earlier, I prefer using the Hot Steel mod for any mecha, so let's place it on Death Knell. For the red module, we have three options. Assault Program, Optimal Reloading, and Rapid Mag. Let's choose and equip them on Death Knell. Great. Now let's move on to the blue module. Here we have quick cooldown plan, concurrent power supply, and efficient transmission. Let's select and equip these modules on Death Knell as well. If you observe closely, you'll notice that Death Knell's damage has now reached the top edge of the circle. This is a positive outcome. Let's proceed to place the blue mod on Death Knell. There we go. We now have a little more flexibility, and Death Knell's damage has been optimized, as shown in the designated damage area. Now let's return to the training grounds and evaluate the effects of the modules. After equipping the modules, Death Knell's durability and damage have increased. It now takes 211 damage for durability compared to the previous 207 damage. Regarding the Scythe ability, it deals 500 durability plus 14 damage based on the mecha's health, in contrast to the previous Scythe damage of 509 durability plus 5 damage. Finally, the Beacon ability now deals 211 damage. Gotcha. My will to protect makes me stronger. Additionally, when you rapidly shoot at the mecha, such as the teddy bear, you'll notice that Death Knell deals higher damage. The Scythe ability inflicts damage ranging from 615 down to 514. So guys, thanks for watching the video, and I hope this explanation helps you understand the changes and optimizations I made in Death Knell.